Hello, my name is Katherine Arndt and I'm the Music and Fine Arts Librarian at Gorgas Library. This is the first video in a series of four that will introduce you to our library's resources for music research. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use Grove Music Online, also known as Oxford Music Online. To start with, let's talk about what Grove Music Online is and how it can be used for research. The Online Grove platform is an extensive encyclopedia of music based on several different dictionaries that were originally only available in print. I'm introducing Grove first because it is a great place to begin your research, as it provides an overview or snapshot of the existing research on a given topic. The primary entries in Grove are called articles. Each article has an author or list of authors, publication dates, and a bibliography. This information is important because when conducting research, transparency is highly valued. That is, we want to take into account the author's perspective and background, how current their research is, and what sources were used to compile the information being presented to us. For example, if you find a Grove article that was published in 2001, you can assume that there may be newer scholarship and more recent findings that aren't included in the 2001 article. This means that you will need to conduct some additional research to fill in the gaps. You'll find Grove articles on a variety of different topics, including people, such as composers and other prominent figures in music, places, instruments, style periods, genres, music terminology, and much more. I'm going to do a quick sample search so you can see these concepts in action. Let's try searching for Mozart. You'll notice that there are quite a few different articles relating to the well-known composer, his legacy, and family. In this case, you may want to be more specific in your search or just plan on scrolling through the results to find the exact article you need. I'm going to go ahead and select the article here on Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart. Since this article is quite extensive, you'll notice that it is divided into sections based on the periods of his life. Under Article Contents, you will also notice that there is a complete list of his works, as well as a bibliography of sources. In this case, the bibliography is divided into sections by topic. It's important to note that within each section, the most recent publications will be at the end of the list. Bibliographies of Grove articles can help you to jumpstart your research, as they document much of the prominent scholarship on a given topic. You can use the information you find in the bibliography to search for resources in our library catalog and other databases. Likewise, the authors of Grove articles are usually music scholars with a background in that particular topic or something closely related. So you will want to keep an eye out for books and journal articles by these scholars.